Hi Pisces, welcome to your reading for March. This is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. At the end of this video, if you are interested, I will also record and extend it to know more specific details on their feelings and intentions for you at this moment. Now let's start with your reading. And first let's shuffle four times. First, let's see what is the overall energy for the month of March for Pisces. It is uh, regarding this connection with a person that may be distant physically from you or that uh, situation where someone left and gave up to this connection um, in the past. So, dealing with a past situation. Now let's see first what may have happened in the past, what were the challenges, so you better know if this reading resonates with you. There was lots of indecision, not taking action, lots of silence treatment, and also there's a possibility that someone may have been juggling people. Let's see about the current energies. It feels like uh, the connection is over completely. It feels like the connection is lost. But one partner wants to manifest that again. One partner is very willing to be back with them. I think this is your energy, Pisces. But let's see more details about what may be affecting you in your subconscious that you are not aware of. You want stability. Now you want something stable, consistent, secure. You don't want anything casual. And maybe you haven't found that person yet, or maybe this person from the past had problems with stability. How do you view the situation? You think that they did not tell you the truth, you feel confused, and uh, you want communication, but you don't expect it happening soon from this person. Now let's see more details about the focus and hopes and fears. Your fear is that you will be stuck to this connection and think and rethink it a lot. So overthinking a lot of past situation where it feels like unfinished business. And you don't like that because you want a clear decision what to do. Do they want, do they feel uh, still about you or not? And uh, your focus is to be with a passionate uh, person. A person that has feelings but is uh, also attracted towards you and has a deep passion for the connection. Now let's see about this person that is currently on your mind. What is their energy? Let's see why the lovers. They are in love with you. They have feelings for you. They may be a water sign, another water sign, maybe another Pisces or Cancer or Scorpio or a Gemini. I think they may be a bit indecisive as well between uh, being at crossroads, needing to make a decision. But I think they have feelings for you at this current moment. Yes, they do have feelings for you and they are putting the blame on you about how it all went And uh, they want to give to this uh, connection. They want to uh, invest into it. So they are very interested now to invest into that, in that connection again. They have feelings, deep feelings for you. Now let's see more details about will they take actions. Yes, I, I think uh, expect uh, a message from this person. They may call or talk. They have been watching you for quite some time with a desire to talk. They may have been stalking you in social media. 
but they have been very resistant to open up because they saw you being guarded and they were a bit confused with themselves also I'm getting a second story that they may have tried to date uh, other people but not successfully and they may have realized that their real feelings are for you I will continue this reading now for more details in the extended where I want to view how does your person feel now how do they view you what are their intentions and the energies of the connection if you want to watch the extended of this video you can find it now in the description box below see you the next reading and bye for now